guess who's back? Hey everyone, it's Max of the 30 Day AI Sprint fame. If you don't know what the 30 Day AI Sprint was, I basically convinced my boss to hack with AI, build a bunch of stuff in public and release it to the community to show everyone what's possible. So it was a big success. People really liked it. And I also got some really good feedback as well. People actually want me to be a bit more thoughtful in the content that I'm making. They want more tutorials, more in-depth breakdowns and all that jazz. The AI Sprint was an experiment to see if people wanted build-in public style content, wanted to be inspired on what's possible out there today. And I would say that's a hard yes from the community. So off the back of all that, I went into brainstorm mode and thought, what's a sustainable successor to the 30 day AI sprint? I present to you the studio. When pitching the NNN team and my esteemed boss, Luis Guzman, which by the way, since his performance reviews right now, please note that I'm in the rain making a video. What did I pitch them? I said that the studio is the centralized hub for NNN's developer advocacy efforts. But between you and me, I just kind of came up with what my dream job would be and, and put that in a brief and, and hope they say yes, which they did. We were gonna call it NNN Labs, but we felt that's a bit too scientist-y and might give the wrong impression. Like I'm definitely not a scientist. I'm a tinkerer, I'm a builder, but I don't think anyone ever accused me of um, having a PhD. PhD. Max, stay on topic. What is the studio? I'm very glad you asked because that's the whole point of this video. The studio is a group of builders. There's myself, your esteemed host, Max to catch. We also have Angel Menendez. More on him in just a few. So as builders, we, well, we build. We work on projects. Each of us comes up with our own projects and they're deliberately broad in scope. So a project could be a really cool automation use case, absolutely. It could be interviewing an AI expert to turn that into a in-depth tutorial series on AI prompting. Could also include renting a house in Greece and getting a bunch of low-code founders to try and launch their startup from said house in Greece, using only the finest low-code tools, of course, such as N8. And in short, our job is to give the people what they want. Something you could use in your personal life, something that you could apply to your business problems but maybe not necessarily solving boring enterprise ETL use cases live on camera. Each project is going to be built in public, very similar to the AI Sprint. The difference is I think the projects will sometimes be a bit longer, a bit more time on a project so that we create higher quality tutorial content and make it easier for you to reproduce and learn from all the stuff we're doing so that you can build your own awesome automations and blow us out the water and go, hey Max and Angel, that's not a use case. This is a use case. On that note, let's hand it over to Anhil to introduce himself. I think you're pretty slick, huh, Max? Well, it's time to bring in the American. America. Hey there, my name is Angel, and for over 15 years, I've helped startups and enterprises document and automate complex processes, making companies more efficient and scalable. My passion lies in connecting processes across departments because a well-designed workflow can transform an organization. Here at NADN Studio, I'm excited to share that knowledge and focus on IT ops, enterprise, and cybersecurity projects. Back to you, Max. It's cutting into my bicycle time. Appreciate that, Angel. So we've got Angel, we've got myself. We're going to work on projects that hopefully blow your mind, have you tell your friends about the, the good word, and, and realistically more budgets so we can do more awesome stuff. Like sending an it into space, I'm still really bullish on that one. This would be a great time to shill that little like, follow button, whichever platform you happen to find yourself on. Uh, it really helps. And then since we got multiple members working on various projects, I'm gonna be doing a weekly vlog where we update you on those projects. And we're also gonna try out some segments, giving you a sneak peek behind the scenes at Edit N. And since through the AI Sprint, I met so many cool folks doing similar stuff to me, building out in public, sharing their work. That'll also be a great space to interview those folks, share their story, um, and hopefully give you more bits of inspiration. And I realized it's a lot cheaper and faster to interview someone that already did the work than do the work, which will give me more time to, to edit down the fun trick shots. The first project that I'll be taking on is an intro to AI agents tutorial series. So one of the biggest feedbacks I got from the AI Sprint was, hey, I'm a newbie, I'm just learning. Is there any great introductory materials to AI agents in NNN? Now, there's definitely some folks out in the community making some, but I thought it would be really good to create basically official, unofficial uh, tutorial series that's gonna get endorsed by NNN's AI team. So I'll be breaking ground on that 
next week. The first episode of the Studio Vlog Gameplay is going to come out on the 29th of November. Planning a great show and tell from one of our community members on a cool workflow template that they built. We'll get an update on Angel's project and what he's chosen. We'll give an update on my intro to AI Agents tutorial series. More on all that on the first episode next week. So make sure to hit the subscribe button because that's going to be coming out on NNN's YouTube channel every week. I'm super geek. For the astute observers, yes, I've been walking the same 15 meter segment because it's raining and it's kind of covered up here. So if you caught that, bonus points. And I'm going to go because it's kind of cold. Now again, Luis, please keep in mind. I'm doing my job out in the rain. All of you guys are in the office right now saying cozy with complimentary coffee. No coffee here, so keep that in mind for performance reviews.